Hey guys, it's Samira and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a how to romanticize school or trying to romanticize school because school is a very negative topic for a lot of us and basically romanticize means like make it seem more charming, more appealing, just like better in a better light because school is just a negative topic so I feel like I'm at the stage now because I've been back at school for two full weeks now where I'm kind of like, you know, over it, over like the social aspect and now we're jumping into learning so I have to like motivate myself to still be okay with school I guess. I don't know. How to put it but yeah i've been seeing a lot of like tiktoks um i guess like more like chilton rory gilmore style like you know doing my homework at a cafe um, walking home thinking like fall-ish vibes i don't know how to explain it exactly i'll put a few examples in but i'm gonna basically try and be trying to do that today making just school seem better and if you haven't gone back to school yet this video is also per perfect for you although i think a lot of people are going back also the weekend or the day after labor day weekend so and yeah this video is for you guys so I wrote down like a few things that I've seen in different TikToks about like how to romanticize school. So the first thing that we're going to be doing is I'm going to make a like school fall playlist. I feel like I always make my playlist at the beginning of a school year and then slowly I add new songs and slowly it gets all like jumbled up and stuff. So I currently have the one that I made around like last fall that I'm going to, I guess I'm gonna make a full new playlist, but I'm gonna take some songs from that, new music and all that good stuff. So yeah, let's get right into that. And if you guys want to follow my Spotify, I'm pretty sure just like Samir Desai, I have it in the description. First, we're gonna start off making a new playlist. I'm gonna just name it School to start off with, and then maybe I'll change the name later. And let's see, description. I don't know what to make this. Okay, I'm gonna make the description Walking Home. There we go. And let's choose the image. Do this picture. Oh, wait, no this picture okay i'm gonna just go through and start adding some songs and then i'll show you guys the playlist at the end and i will have the playlist linked in the description everything and like they just like this on repeat one i literally love and then like they have like different little mixes for you oh my god spotify i used to have used to use amazon music but this is so much better didn't take too long took like 15 20 minutes because i feel like i mostly knew the songs i wanted um but here it is i changed the uh title a little bit to school nights instead the um description a little bit but i'll just show you guys the gist here is my song i'll put a few of my favorites on the screen do is i'm gonna put together some fall outfits for this week um it is still like kind of warm where i live it's still like 70 degrees i think right now it's like around like 72 but literally air conditioning in schools i don't know if this is just my school but you will always catch people wearing jeans and like big sweatshirts even in the dead of summer because the air conditioning is so intense so i'm gonna put together some fall outfits i find whenever i have like cute outfits i do feel like school is more fun and enjoyable i love getting compliments on my outfits my little favorite thing and i just feel like so 
like well organized, like fresh and clean for school that it makes it better. So I love doing that to romanticize school. Also, I want to do a little quick outfit check because this was like one of my favorite winter slash fall outfits last year. Uh, sweater vest is from Brandy. My collar is collared um, t-shirt is literally from Amazon and I got it for like a couple bucks. And my necklace is from at shop by Rithy on Instagram. Literally love it. My jeans are from Hollister. So I compiled some of like my fallish stuff, but I'm just not realizing a lot of it's more wintery, but it's okay. Um, this one screams fall. This is just like this red flannel that I wear every year, most likely to go like apple picking or something. Next is surprise surprise blue. It has like this little swoosh, Nike swoosh, and down the sleeve it also says Nike. And I actually got this from Kohl's I think last year, and it's really cute. It gives me like vintage Nike sweatshirt vibes, and that was like a big thing last year. And this, this is pretty fallish. I like this from Brandy. Uh, it's just like a long sleeve. I like to wear like a sweater vest over it. I, I think I've worn this one over it, and then I have like a bigger sweater vest too that I would wear over it. This is also from Brandy, and I got this this year. It's like this matcha hoodie. If you want to see me like style it more, um, I did uh, a back to school video, and this was one of the pieces in it. I love this piece, and yeah, it's just pretty basic. It's like it's like really light color, and I don't really buy a lot of like co different colored uh, sweatshirts. I usually try to stick or uh, not sweatshirts, hoodie. I just stick to like a gray or like green. So I love that. I have another sweater vest, which is from Hollister. I got this uh, a few days ago, I think, a couple weeks ago maybe. I don't know. <laughs> pretty cute, just like this um, Ardella. Is that how you say Ardella? Uh, design, and then this. This t-shirt that I got custom made. I don't know. It's like my only short sleeve shirt in this compile, but I like it for fall because it's black, but has like a little orangey design. For bottoms, I will be wearing these like new black dad jeans a lot as well. This skirt and also the jeans I'm wearing right now with a lot of these tops. And I also have some other pairs of jeans in the wash right now, which there's like a darker wash with more uh, rips in it in the wash as well. Like this more like straight jean style versus the mom jean style, which I actually thrifted last year. Now I'm gonna go study and get some of my homework done so I don't have a lot to do tomorrow. And if you live in a little small town like Rory Gilmore where you can just, you know, walk on over here to a diner and study with your friends, good for you. But I don't. I live on a house. I live in a house with on a street with a bunch of other houses and you have to drive or bike or something to get to like a shop or whatever. So I'm gonna be turning my backyard into a little cafe. So yeah, I'm just gonna be like studying outside. It's really sunny today. Nice weather. So I recommend doing this to make your homework seem better uh, i love doing my homework outside when it's nice out and you know having a little snack while you do it act like you're in a cafe if you can't go to one so let's go do that i'm gonna show you guys how i'm gonna make it more cafe like i'm gonna put some music on get some food so the cafe just brought me my food i have this uh coffee it's pumpkin spice coffee from this um very unique and um, special small business. And I also have this little uh, Nutella sandwich bun type of thing, almost like a croissant, but it, the bread's not a croissant. So yeah, and I'm going to just sit here and work a little in this cafe, such nice outdoor seating and stuff. We're gonna just work for a little bit. And I did bring Bruno outside, so the cafe obviously so he's gonna hang out with me and we're gonna just chill uh i what i love to do uh to just make school better i don't know make it more enjoyable is i love taking notes for some reason so after i take notes for like science or math it's at school i like to come home and redo them make them just more neat and use my fun little highlighters and stuff like that
Alright guys, I think that's going to be about it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and like just like the little things I did to try to romanticize school. And I hope you guys all have like a great back to school season, um, great year, back great school year. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!